Alibaba opened up 10% this morning and did the Chinese government just pave the way for a potential Ankoop IPO? That's what we're going to cover in this video. So guys, smash that like button and subscribe if you're new. You're watching more money. Let's get it. What's up guys and welcome back to the channel where the goal here is to help at least a thousand people achieve financial independence much sooner. And let's dive right into this news so you can see here that Alibaba Group's shares actually opened up 10%, but as the news was getting digested, it looks like as of right now, the investors are understanding that this is just one step in a long regulatory process to an eventual Ant Group IPO. And what do I mean by that? Well, here's the article. China accepted Ant's financial holding bid. So in other words, China has accepted the fact that Ant Group is going to become a financial holding company. And so what does that mean? Well, China's central bank has agreed to accept Ant Group's application to set up a financial holding company, which effectively clears the path for Ant Group to potentially revive its listing plans. Now, the article did say that the People's Bank of China's acceptance signals that approvals are expected and Ant is poised to emerge from a regulatory crackdown. However, I'd like to take a step back here and say that this is worded more optimistic than what I feel that reality is going to be, at least in my opinion. There's still many hurdles to overcome, including what exactly will be Alibaba's share of the company at the end of the regulatory process. You already know as an Alibaba shareholder that you're going to lose a substantial portion of Alibaba's ownership in Ant Group as a result of this regulatory process. So what exactly is it going to look like at the end of the day? But the key point here, of course, is that once Ant Group is able to set up the financial holding company, it can fold key operations into the entity. And Ant Group did say earlier when the news reports were coming out that they were going towards an IPO, they did say that the company has no plans right now to initiate an IPO. However, the company's chairman did say last year that the company will eventually go public. And I truly believe that the goal is still to get Ant Group to list publicly if it makes sense for the company. In other words, are they able to get a reasonable valuation? Now you can see here from my model, I've shown you guys this before. I am valuing an immaterial contribution to earnings from Ant Group. And therefore any good news for Ant Group could provide material increases to valuations of Alibaba, including mine. However, I'm not going to get excited over little pieces of good news. It has to be something substantial. So this news is not having me change anything with respect to my valuation of Ant Group's contribution in the Alibaba model. It is still immaterial and it'll remain immaterial until we get something substantial. And note here, guys, that because the valuations of many companies have come down, Alibaba is now no longer the cheapest company on the tracker. There's two names that are actually cheaper on the tracker. So in order for you guys to get access to that tracker, you can get that at the lower tier that the Patreons get access to. And once again, there's never any risk to you because if you decide to try it out and then you decide that it's not for you, no problem. Let me know in the app within the first 30 days and I'll fully refund your first month subscription. And interestingly enough, once people have gotten access to the tracker, nobody's actually requested a refund. So that's very interesting and it really shows that there's real value here. Now, the other thing that you got to pay attention to is that I put out a video yesterday where a Wharton University professor said that a potential recession is already baked into the valuation of the market suggesting that it might not necessarily go lower. And I investigate that and argue that I believe that the market has room to drop further. And you can get to that video right here. 